Welcome to Dishes with Michelle, part two. <laughs> the video is running a little long. I haven't done dishes, so thanks for coming back. I love to uh, dress in my pretty things. Look, I got a little, um, what do you call it, petticoat on underneath. videos with you all when I can. I let the dishes go so long this time they don't all fit in one load. I have to do another load today. Yeah, it's Saturday. It's so nice outside. I'm actually, I want to go out there and lay in the sun. It's the last day. It's going to be like 70 degrees. So I'm going to get naked and I'm going to go lay out and get some more tan. Uh, last chance for some tan before the end of the year. Look, so far I did this whole year without getting a farmer tan. I do what you call reverse tanning. And I have these little sleeves that you put on your arms that keep your tan even because you know how it is you have your shirt on and you go outside and this you just get a farmer tan over the summer so I put these things on and then I go lay out back naked except for these and it makes your tan even how exciting so tanning tip from old Michelle <laughs> a tanning tip for you so that's what I'm going to do when I'm done here with you guys. I'm going to go out there. Um, unfortunately, I have a shadow from my garage. I'm going to see if I can't find a sunny spot to lay out there naked without my neighbors being able to see me. I really wouldn't care if they did see me. Okay, there we have it. Michelle did the dishes. <clears throat> I'm getting my back's a little sore, so I'm having a hard time like keeping. You know, usually I can bend over and touch the ground with my legs together like this. Oh, oh, no, my back hurts. Oh, look, I can still do it though. Oh, it's a struggle though. Um, I don't know why my back's hurting. Well, I do know why, because I worked hard this week. Yeah, we. I'm a contractor, so we did a big granite top, and I was carrying a big microwave by myself, and oh, I could feel that. So, okay, what do we got? Stitch. Yep, should be good. Yay! All right. So, let's get a fresh, clean rag to wash our knives. Let's put that there for a minute, let it dry. We grab a fresh one. Wash all our knives. You never want to put these in the dishwasher. As I've explained, um, it'll mess the temper up. 
So I like to give them a hot rinse. Or I would say like a hot wipe with your egg. You know, really, you should wash these right after you use them. You should never sit around on your counter like this. So I'm a bad girl. And I definitely need a spanking because of that. So if you'd like to spank me, come and see me and I definitely deserve it. Ow, oh, it's getting very hot. It's getting very hot. Okay, so now that they've all got their hot rinse, just like I said, they should never be allowed to lay around like this. Um, I'm just a lazy, lazy girl, so. When you guys aren't around to watch me, I'm, I misbehave and I don't do my chores. All right, so now we get with some soap. Ooh, look, I missed. I missed. Here, we can get that. Now we wash them with the soap. And this is why you should wear an apron. I'll just stay very far away. since I've had to um, stand in heels. I broke my toe about a couple months ago, if you recall, if you've seen my videos. Um, but it's all better now. It feels normal again, I think. I have normal toes again. you use your little your good knives you should wash them right away and put them back but I'm hi and I'm kind of naughty Does anybody like square dancing? Um, my wonderful, wonderful daddy Elvis um, is sending me a square dancing dress and he wants me to do photos in his cute little uh, square dancing dress and I'd love if somebody else wanted to go square dancing. <laughs> Where do you square dance? That's weird. I don't know if I would like square dancing. Oh, I guess everybody would like square dancing. It's fun. 
kind of silly. You know, I grew up in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Um, German culture. My grandma was German. Um, so polka. Polka was the thing. Um, every wedding or get together, it was oompa. Polka. Roll out the barrel. We'll have a barrel of fun. Roll out the barrel. Yes. Polka. Yeah, we lived in a real German part of town, too. It's very segregated there. <laughs> Dishes with Michelle! Dishes with Michelle! Dishes with Michelle. Oh, the floor is a little wet. Here, let's find a dry rag. Excuse me. Now, I was thinking about wearing blue. Oh, look, see, I got a mess. See, this is why you should wear a an apron. Wear an apron, not a apron. And I almost wore tights. What do you think about wearing some blue tights? But I thought the color was just strange with this, because then I saw those shoes, and I was like, oh, it's over. I have to wear those shoes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 